Hi, I'm John Culhane, and I'm a professor of law at the Widener University School of Law and director of the Health Law Institute. And last Friday, I was lucky enough to be the keynote speaker at Constitution Day at the Widener University main campus. And it was really fun to go up there and to talk about some of the issues that matter most to me. In particular, I was discussing how the LGBT community has been able to use the Constitution in an attempt to secure the basic equality that citizens are supposed to be able to take for granted. And so I went through a little bit of the constitutional history of equality and pointed out that when it came to marriage and the equality that people seek in marriage, it's not just the gay and lesbian community that have been fenced out for a long time. For example, when we go back to slave times, it turns out that uh, blacks couldn't, uh, couldn't marry, uh, legally certainly they couldn't marry, and even ceremonially they could marry only at the sufferance of their slave owners. When that uh, um, horrible institution came to an end, blacks were still prohibited from marrying whites and vice versa. As far as women are concerned, they were long barred from the kinds of equality that we now associate with the marital relationship. Once they married, they actually disappeared as people and were taken up uh, basically in their husband's identity. So they couldn't bring suit in their own name. Um, they couldn't own property. It, uh, that was all sort of up to their husbands. And so I think we could see now sort of a connection between the LGBT rights movement in terms of our uh, struggle to gain equality and the struggle other groups have faced and uh, take that as a sort of a symbol of how a, a country uh, treats a certain minority. In other words, is it fair in terms of its marriage laws? If it's not, that tells you something about the basic denial of dignity and equality. Thanks for listening, and if you're interested in finding out more, consult my blog, wordinedgewise.org. Thanks.